In just five minutes, I'm gonna show you guys how to connect a custom AI chatbot to Discord. So for this tutorial, you guys are going to need RunBear. Now, I do have a 50% off coupon down below, so be sure to check that out. All right, so once you're signed in, let's go ahead and create our first assistant. Now, we can choose between OpenAI, Claude A, or Gemini. Now, you don't need API keys if you choose one of these three, which is absolutely amazing. Now, if you choose one of these down below, you do need API keys. However, you can copy your custom GPTs and your custom assistants that are already made on your GPT account, which is absolutely amazing. All right, so I'm going to choose the OpenAI assistants. And today we're going to make a customer service chatbot that support for a cell phone service. Now, I'm just making this up, but you can make it into anything you want. Now, the cool thing is, is RunBear actually provided us with a chatbot creator. So you can click this button here. And now we can actually create our own chatbot prompts really quickly using their own creator. So let's go ahead and do that. So I put in, I want a customer service chatbot for cell phone service. And honestly, that looks pretty good for a prompt. So let's just try that out and see what it is. So I'm copying that in, paste it here. We're going to put customer support assistant. Beautiful. All right, now we're gonna scroll down and select our model. Now, I don't think we need GPT-40. I believe the mini is just fine. And we can actually use RunBear's OpenAI Access, which is amazing. So we don't have to put any API keys. That's really cool. And the cool thing is, is we can create a vector database instantly. Now, I showed you guys how to do this in a previous video, and it took me about five minutes to create a vector database using Pinecone. That being said, here we can do it instantly. We can connect Google Drive, and instantly everything in the Drive folder is now AI memory. Today, we're going to be using the files, however. So I'm going to upload the resolution document and the call transcripts here. Beautiful. Now we can actually give it some extra actions right here. Now this is really easy again, and in it end we'd have to connect all these API keys and give it tons of services. Here we don't have to do that at all. So I don't really need any of these at the current time, so I'm going to go ahead and leave it blank. And then we have some advanced options here. None of these we're going to be using today, but they are really cool. Let's click create. All right, now that our assistant's created, let's go ahead and connect it to Discord and see how it works. So I'm gonna click on Discord here, and it brings me straight to a login screen. I'm gonna select Horizon, let's click Continue. Let's go ahead and authorize it right now. Beautiful, and it looks like it is connected. And Discord is now activated. I can now connect my LLM apps into Discord. So I'm going to give it its own channel. We're gonna put it in the channel testing. And it is connected. We're gonna trigger on bot mention and trigger on thread replies. So all I have to do is put at run beer. So let's save that and let's go ahead and try it out. All right, now we have to add run bear to the channel real quick. So let's go ahead and click add members and roles and let's find run bear. And click on RunBear app and click done. And now RunBear is in here. So now let's ask RunBear a question. And let's see how it responds. And it created a thread. So let's see the thread. And he's typing. Let's see what he says. Wow, okay, okay. Check signal strength, restart my phone, check message settings, clear cache and messaging app, upload your device. I mean, honestly, it sounds pretty cool. Let's try one more. Can I update my bill? Can I update my billing information? Let's see what it says. It tells us exactly how to update our billing information. So as you guys can see, this really reduces the time it takes to test and deploy AIs to different services, which is absolutely amazing. Really love this service. As I mentioned previously, there is a 50% off coupon code down below in the description. And I hope that this video helped you guys out. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And you guys have a wonderful day.